I would just freak out and and just like almost die. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> that's just, that is such a sad answer. Mm, tasty. And what is up, Stu Crew? John Based out here. And Shannon Truex. And today, the Olympics. You have a guy that is trapped in a bathroom who has to break out. You have face damaging water. All sorts of Sochi problems going on to the point that there's a Twitter site dedicated to them. So we wanted to find out what people think. Have you guys been following the Olympics at all? Yes, we have. What do you think of them? The games themselves are doing pretty well. Everything outside the arenas is a train wreck. What do you think is the worst Sochi problem that you've heard so far? It's the accommodations. The dirty water. The dogs. Rabbit. They're talking about females being watched in the shower. I kind of find that offensive. The $51 billion they spent. $51 billion? God, what can they do besides host a little uh, city and have all these malfunctions going on? This is my, one of my favorites. Stacy Sinclair tweeted that her hotel has no water, and then if restored, the desk says, do not use on your face because it contains something very dangerous. If it's face damaging water, it's body damaging water. The face is attached to the body, so... Yeah, feel free to brush your teeth, right? There's plenty of places I've been where you don't drink the water. There are very few places that say, don't put on your face. Would you drink that water? Absolutely not. No, I will not. Let's do some shots. Looks it looks like, like an alcoholic, oh, oh. like some scotch or something oh, like that. Come on, it looks like a medical specimen. It's not scotch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I might drink it. I, it depends. You know, if I'm very thirsty, why not? Oh, William. <laughs> <laughs> William, I'm just reclaimed after your answers. I, you're the first person who actually said they would drink the Sochi water. If you look at some of the pictures of Sochi, most of the hotels aren't even done. They look like they were just started construction right before the athletes got on the plane. They look like the um, Barbie doll houses where there's only the front but not the back. Barbies are much more well decorated. Gian Gomeshi, he wrote, my hotel room has no internet, no hot water, no curtains, and no furniture. On the plus side, three of the four lights work. So there's a good thing. You got three. On the plus side, three of four lights work. Okay, well. That's okay. He looks at the glass as half full, half full of Sochi water. Please do not throw the toilet paper in the toilet. Really? <laughs> there should be no toilet paper in the toilets in Sochi at all. See, no. No. I would lay it down. They said throw, so I would lay it down. <laughs> in the toilet? Yes, of course. As long as I don't throw it, I guess I'm okay. We got a smart one here. Okay, I'm not throwing it. I'm laying it down. I'm laying it down. There you go, like a little New Media Stew dance move. It is, laying it down. I'm not getting near that toilet. Johnny Quinn got locked in there. You hear about that? I'm going outside. It's safer. Olympian Johnny Quinn, who's a bobsledder, got stuck in the bathroom at Sochi and just broke his way out. That's funny. I love that. I think that's a, just a pure oh, American that. answer to a Russian oh, problem. Oh. When you got to go, you got to go. But when you got to get out, you got to get the hell out. I might put some of that toxic water around the door so it melts the door down and makes it easier to get out of there. No, I would have to get out of there. I mean, there's there's no food, there's no TV, there's no media stew, no computer. What would you do in the bathroom? There's no new media stew in the bathroom. <laughs> that was the best part right there. It doesn't get any better than that for a plug. There's a lot of stray dogs running around Russia and the Olympic Committee didn't really want them embarrassing Russia during the ceremonies, so there were reports of people randomly shooting stray dogs in the streets. That's uh, animal cruelty and I don't tolerate that. Animals have rights like people. That's horrible. They should round them up and put them in a pound and not shoot them. I think it's disgusting when anything has to die for no reason. That is disgusting, Sochi. If you are actually shooting dogs in the street, God bless you and may your karma be swift. I think they poured that that water on them and that's how they killed them. One of the biggest headline making stories of the Sochi Olympics is Bob Costas's eye. Actually eyes because I think he got conjunctivitis in both of them. He looks pretty bad. Oh poor Bob Costas. Yikes. I feel bad for him. I'm surprised that he went on when they were looking that bad. So that And so often too. He was back night after night so we got to yeah. see the progression. That's an issue. I think um, you know because glamour is the big thing. Well he yeah. also has to be able to read the teleprompter. Yeah. I farted on his pillow. Bad news. I'm John Basedow. And I'm Shannon Truex. And your culture has officially been popped. Booyah! What's up everyone? It's Ronnie from Jersey Shore and you're watching the movie with Stu with JB.